I'm sorry, I, I, have, I have no idea what you're talking about. Please, okay, just, just please don't deny it. You're in love with Sonny. He's the man that you want to be with. Where is this coming from? Does it matter? Yes, it does, because something happened to make you say this, and I, and I want you to tell me what it is. Actually, I didn't read your journal. I was tempted to, but I didn't want to be that guy. Which guy is that? The one who's so insecure that he invades his partner's privacy. Paul, why, why would you think that I, I, I would I don't think be that, Will. I know. I mean, deep down, I've, I've, I've always known. I just didn't want it to be real. I mean, talking to you now, it's just so clear. You, you want to be with Sonny. I'm not leaving you. Yeah, maybe not now. But eventually you would. Sonny is your soulmate, and you are madly in love with him. Paul, I... <laughs> and the only reason that you're still here with me right now is because, uh... I'm in a wheelchair. Right? Right. I'm so sorry. Can I explain? You don't have to. I need to. I need you to know that I never meant for any of this to happen. I was in love with you, Paul. I, 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 you know, I wanted a future with you, and then memories came back. Feelings for Sonny. I tried to fight it at first. It was like my, my past and my present were colliding, you know, and there was you and there was Sunny. And you, you, you knew you to choose. I tried so hard to push those feelings away. I wanted them, I wanted them to stay in the past. But they wouldn't. Because those memories and those experiences, they're in my blood. They're in my bones. They're who I am. But that in no way invalidates or diminishes what we had. Paul, my love for you was real. Just, uh, just didn't compare to your love for Sonny.